This is some search and destroy gameplay at the Airsoft Factory in Kankakee, Illinois. The event is hosted by Mir Tactical. There are three rounds with two respawns. My team will be attempting to defend first. The rules are very loose. No minimum engagement, no fall auto inside, no shooting in the stairs. Kinda. I want to talk about this particular event further in a future video, in which I'll review all the details for the people that are new to this field. I'll also be doing reviews for all of the Mere Tactical events and other repeating events in the Midwest region that I've been to. Enjoy. I do not have a sidearm on. There you go. So right off the jump, I've been to this field before and I've played it a couple of times. This door that we are going in at this time is supposed to be open and unlocked. Unfortunately, the refs forgot to unlock it and that caused a lot of confusion and disrupted our plan. Oh no, dude. What? How are we supposed to get upstairs? Are you kidding me? No. I don't know how to get upstairs now. Mid stairs, yeah. Go, go, go. Unfortunately, we have to double back at this point and go up one of two other stairwells. The mid section stairwell, which will be up on my left here, and then uh, a further back stairwell all the way to the back left. Get up there! Yeah. This was actually the first game of the day. There was no warm up, no TDM, no nothing like that. There was a lot of new players of the field and they were really unsure of the layout of the building. So uh, they did their best to get around. All right, is anybody upstairs yet or no? That was a hit. I got him. Right side's clear. Yeah, so there is a huge problem on this particular day, and that is hey, people not calling hits. It happened Come. constantly the whole day. Yep. Uh, again, maybe it was just a lot of new players, and Keep they didn't want to be out so here. quick, but. It was what Careful. it was, and we did the best with what we had. So you use it like a ladder? Right side of this main hard point. Okay? Mm -hmm. Keep peeking. Good luck. I got you. Bud, just don't stand up. Hold that. So at this point, the opposing yeah. team has completely locked down the second floor. We just took a really long time trying to get up the stairs. Uh, the team just really didn't push up that far, awesome. but that's okay. Like I said, there was a lot of new players, so it takes some time. Clear. So come, I didn't come. have any problems taking point for most come. of the games. Blue team, push up. Somebody stay here. That's fine, leave him. Come with me. Somebody watch this. So that was kind of unfortunate, but it was kind of like necessary to get us up to those stairs and get moving a little bit. I'd overheard some guys talking about uh, two people on the opposing team outside uh, midsection of the building. 
that weren't calling their hits. So I decided to go see if I could do something about that because I knew we didn't have much of a chance at getting the bomb back at this point. So maybe we could slow them down. <laughs> yeah, my gun was definitely functioning properly and firing BBs. There wasn't any jams or misfeeds. They just took that full auto and just walked away with from it. And it continues to happen throughout the day. We lost that first round primarily because that front door was locked. Uh, we spoke to the refs and we all agreed that it was a good idea to keep that door locked uh, for the second round. If we won the second round, then we do a third round tiebreak with all the doors unlocked. So at this point, I take point again. Um, I had a couple of guys with me. One of them had the bomb, and I would lead them up towards the planting area. Uh, and then we get here. as much of the team in there as possible. Unfortunately, just like the door being locked, the refs never gave anybody like a walk through of the building. So we didn't actually know where the plant site was. We just knew it was somewhere right, in the stay. mid section of the building. Spread out a bit. We knew that we were close. David, I'm reducing my side arm. Uh, I think. Hey, where's Ref? Yeah. Ref! Yeah. Sit tight. Hey, break out of the, We got to get out of the spot. Right here, right here. Right here. All right, where's the plant? Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. It's clear right, clear right. Gimme. No, not that, not that. So oh, just like us, the opposing team had to go first floor. They went all the way down and around and uh, tried to get behind us. Stay here. Stay here. I'm going to fall back. So you can hear one of the refs saying multiple times, let people up and down the stairwells and give them a chance to get up and down the stairwells. Everybody who's played airsoft in the multi-story building knows that the stairwells are crazy deadly. Um, unfortunately, the rule for the stairs changed constantly. Almost every single round, people were shooting, people were coming in late, and it made it crazy. And we kind of took care of that later in the day. Um, unfortunately, it was kind of late uh, after lunch, and a lot of people had left because of some of that stuff. I think you missed. Did you hit me? Yeah, I Oh, sorry. I didn't feel it. Hit! So unfortunately, I checked uh, left I and in, can't look at both <laughs> corners at the same time, so we got killed that one. But we did hold the point, we did win the second round. So this is the third round tiebreaker. Uh, they did open up all the doors at this point. So every door is open, we get up there pretty damn fast. Careful, careful. This is what was supposed to happen on the first round, but unfortunately it didn't. Go. Plant, fall back. Suppress. Yep. Guys here. Uh, I really enjoy playing with uh, a lot of right new here. players, all, all uh, especially giving here. them something fun, like a good experience, uh, trying to be reasonable, be nice, and, and chatting. 
stuff Don't like that and get him as involved as possible. Uh, this is a perfect day for that. Like I said, I think if the rules weren't so like wild, I think it would have been a better experience for a lot of people. Don't waste ammo, but take a shot here and there. Just make sure you suppress it here and there. I can't remember how long we were supposed to hold the point for, but it was like five or ten minutes or something like that. Watch the stairs! Stay there. I'm gonna cross right in front of you. Sorry. There's three of them. Three of them. Suppress for me. On the door. Right here. Suppress that for me. I'm sure there's other people out there like me. I can't sit for that long without getting into some sort of engagement, so I had to get it on. Stand by. And you're gonna see again a whole bunch of people not calling hits. Every single one of those shots was good. Uh, putting them right down that slot, so I, I don't know what they're doing. Hey, right there, right there. Go to the stairs, go to the stairs. Come through and go to the stairs. We'll just hold this corner. Hold that. Sprinting all the way back to the spawn, respawning, and then sprinting all the way back up to help defend, uh, we ran into another one of the most common problems, and that was friendly fire. Unfortunately, some people, they just don't have that trigger discipline, and I paid for it a lot that day. Yeah, this is another one. I was coming up from behind, and somehow they still turned around and shot backwards, and killed their own teammate even though we were all up there together check fire everybody we did end up winning at the end and that's kind of all that matters to me yeah, by the objective out. thanks for watching hopefully you enjoyed there's gonna be more gameplay and reviews coming out soon